The Brooklyn Nets have recently fired their head coach Kenny Atkinson. Yesterday on First Take, Stephen A reported the three candidates for Brooklyn Nets to hire. One, Tyron Wu, two, Mark Jackson, and three, this will shock the NBA world if this happened, Greg Popovich. Imagine Greg Popovich leaving San Antonio to become the Brooklyn Nets' new head coach. What's up, guys? It's your boy, Will. Back at it again with another video, and today we're going to be talking about imagine if the Brooklyn Nets really hired Greg Popovich as the Brooklyn Nets' new head coach. Now, there's been talks about Tyron Lu. And there's also been talks about Mark Jackson. But can you just imagine if Greg Popovich really left San Antonio? This is not Kawhi Leonard leaving San Antonio. But at the same time, I can actually see Popovich leaving a little bit because he might want to give the hands to Tim Duncan to take over the show in San Antonio. But I don't know. Just imagine if Greg Popovich really became Brooklyn Nets head coach, coaching up Kyrie and KD. Here's, here's what is going to happen. If that would have happened, here's what Brooklyn Nets season will look like next year. First of all, I believe KD would not come back right away uh, to start the season next year. Obviously, I think KD might come back, honestly, might maybe in Christmas Day or January. I think KD's taking his time coming back because he's coming back from a tour Achilles. That is a hard injury to come back from, especially in past history when many other players getting that injury. Those players have not been the same at all. So with KD, he's a sniper. He's a sniper short in there. He's a shooter. He's, he's going to lose some of his athleticism, but he's still going to have a shooting ability. I still believe he will be averaging at least 24, 25 points per game. Then you have Kyrie with him, which Kyrie in previous history, his leadership has not been the best at all. I believe KD, it will still it will be KD's team once he comes back. But if Brooklyn has hired Greg Popovich as the new head coach, Greg Popovich would turn Kyrie Irving into a better player and better leader. Believe that. If he doesn't, he will be gone. That is Greg Popovich for you. Greg Popovich is one of the best if not the best head coach of all time in NBA history. Let's put that inside. Now, with the other pieces of the Brooklyn Nets on that team, you got Spencer Dinwiddie, Karis LeVert, Jared Allen, Joe Harris in the crew. It, it sounds amazing adding Greg Popovich to that. That sounds like a San Antonio Spurs team, having young talent and adding more pieces to the team and also developing them to become better versions of themselves. You add KD and Kyrie to that mix with Spencer Dinwiddie, Joe Harris, Kels Avert, and the crew, and then add Greg Popovich as the head coach. And it's gonna be very interesting. Now we know Greg Popovich is getting up in the age, but I honestly do believe he can coach two to three four more, four more years, honestly. He has a lot more in the tape, in my opinion. The team he has right now has not much talent. I mean, Marcus Aldridge is is decent. We know who DeMar DeRozan is. You know you're going to get out of him. He's just a good mid-range jump shooter. He's a he's a good player, but he's not he's not a great player. I think this season he's actually been pretty solid. He's actually developing a three-point shot. It's just some to his game he lacks, and there's a lot more he needs to improve on for them to be better. That's why San Antonio, this San Antonio just doesn't have much talent on that team. You put Greg Popovich on the Brooklyn Nets, I believe the Brooklyn Nets are going to be have a number one seed in the East next year. Probably going to finish 61 and 21. 61 and 21. And I believe they will go to the NBA Finals. <laughs> it will be no leadership problems because Greg Popovich will develop Kyrie Irving into becoming a better leader. We know what he did with Tony Parker to Tim Duncan. We know what he did with Kawhi. That's how Kawhi developed to be an amazing player. The problem with Kawhi and San Antonio is when he got injured, he was mad about their the health thing in San Antonio. Now, personally, I don't believe Greg Popovich would ever leave San Antonio. I think he should retire 
as a spur, as one of the best coaches of all time in San Antonio. But for Kyrie and KD, if it's one coach they will love to have, it's definitely Greg Popovich. Other than Tyron Lue, it's, it's Greg Popovich. If they can somehow pull that off, Brooklyn is going to come out the East. They will go to the NBA Finals, and they probably will win it all. That is my opinion. But yeah, man, I appreciate y'all tuning in for this video. Just, again, just imagine if it would happen. It, it might happen. You know, Stephen A. be saying some crazy stuff sometimes, but the top three candidates so far for Brooklyn is Tyron Lue, Mark Jackson, possibly Greg Popovich. We'll see what happens, man. But yeah, man, once again, I think, thank y'all for tuning in for this video. If y'all new to my channel, well, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And also turn on post notifications for another NBA video I'll be dropping every week. I drop weekly NBA content just like this. Also, click on both of the videos on the top left screen and top right screen. Thank y'all for tuning in for this video. It's been your boy, Will, and I'm out. This hoes got me sidetracked. This hoes got me sidetracked. Man, these hoes got me sidetracked. I don't even mind that. Man, this hoes got me sidetracked. These hoes got me sidetracked. Goddamn, I'm so...